Namaskar farmer friends from Soul of Krishi. Today I will attempt to clear certain doubts in the minds of farmers about the use of Arka Microbial Consortium, a biofertilizer of par excellence invented by ICAR IIHR Bengaluru. Arka Microbial Consortium is popularly known as AMC and available both as powder as well as liquid form. AMC is a biofertilizer and a bioinoculant which is applied to the soil, sprayed on plants and can also be applied through root feeding. It has been used by farmers growing pomegranate, pepper, ginger, vegetables, flower crops, areca nut, coconut and many other crops. There is a suppression campaign by consultants, so-called doctors and dealers about the popularity of AMC as it is a competitor against fungicides, antibiotics and other bioinoculants. So please buy from a genuine supplier and look for ICAR, IIHR symbol on all packets and bottles. If you have any doubt on genuity or problems, you may contact Soul of Krishi. The basic question farmers and other people ask is whether AMC can be applied to all crops. Yes, it can be applied to any crop because basically we do not apply AMC to crops but rather we apply to soil and the same is sprayed on the crop. AMC is applied to soil to enhance the soil health and soil productivity and to minimize the soil borne diseases. Therefore, any crop grown on any soil treated with AMC will benefit from its application. So it can be applied to any crop. Several farmers ask how is it different from any other biofertilizers and bioinoculants available in the market? It is this point where AMC outsmarts all other biofertilizers and bioinoculants. Farmers must know that biofertilizers are microorganisms and their efficiency depends upon the organisms present in the biofertilizer. The biofertilizer organisms available in the market are not properly controlled and the quality is not maintained. Compatibility of one organism with another is not ensured. Quantity recommended is also not standardized. As a result, most of these biofertilizers get mixed up and the efficiency of these strains get weakened. Their success in different regions are not tested. Temperature and soil sustainability is not known. Hence, many a times farmers say the biofertilizers are not working. What about AMC? AMC is not the same. Taking into account all these confusions and mismanagement of biofertilizers in the market, IIHR has isolated together a new set of microorganisms which are entirely different from all these biofertilizers available in the market. Developed and registered in its name, the product's purity and efficacy which is maintained by specialized scientists in this area. Instead of a single organism-based biofertilizer, IIHR has made a consortium of three organisms which can survive together and work in harmony and this made AMC the first ever microbial consortium in the country. The manufacture is done under the guidance of IIHR scientists. Hence, quality, efficacy and recommendations are managed by the institute and to a great extent the marketing is, is under control without adulteration as of now. Then how does AMC work? AMC works in an entirely different way than all other biofertilizers and bioinoculants. Firstly, the organisms present in the AMC can work in a wide range of temperatures, soil types and soil pH. So AMC can be used throughout the country. Secondly, the organisms present in this consortium can work in a symbiotic manner and efficiently work together without any antagonistic effect on each other. It has the ability to, to solubilize phosphorus, potassium and zinc in the soil. It mobilizes all nutrients through better mineralization from organic material in the soil and it fixes atmospheric nitrogen into the soil. So if AMC is used, you can reduce up to 25% fertilizer application and save money. It promotes plant growth through production of growth hormones and hence plant grow robust with internal resistance. 
It suppresses most of the soil-borne pathogens. Since most of the pathogens originate from the soil, spraying AMC on plants control plant diseases as well. What is the best method and time to use for best results? IHR is the first to recommend AMC for foliar spray because of two main reasons. It produces growth hormones and hence its spray will enhance plant growth. Since it suppresses soil borne pathogens and since most diseases originate from soil, AMC spray will minimize diseases on the plants as well. Treat nursery with AMC by mixing with the media and irrigating it with AMC solution. While transplanting, we can dip seedlings roots with the AMC solution. If it is a seed material like sugarcane, potato, ginger, banana suckers, etc., then treat the seed material with a slurry of AMC before planting. Next, after transplanting, drench the seedlings with AMC liquid. During the growth and fruiting stage, regularly spray AMC liquid on the crop. If it is root or stem diseases of trees like coconut and areca nut, then go for root feeding. AMC is an organic product. It manages nutrient availability and supply, promotes growth and suppresses diseases. Thus, it is the best product for organic production. AMC has shown success in management of diseases for crops like pomegranate, ginger, black pepper, potato, tomato, papaya, flowers, areca nut, coconut, betel nut vine, most of the vegetables, nursery diseases and many others. These promising success stories are first-hand experiences from farmers apart from research channels. Farmers can use it on any crop and on any soil at anywhere. Always make sure you purchase only the IIHR licensed persons to assure quality of AMC. Use it in the right way, in the right quantity and at the right time for best results. Contact Soul of Krishi for further information and guidance. If you like this video and want to get notifications about such videos from our channel, please subscribe to Soul of Krishi and don't forget to click the bell icon. Thank you.